Okay, Mark, here we go. There's the exhaust system, wheelie bars. I got my buddy Sean here with me. He's my light guy. So we're going to go under here. Oh, there's wheelie bar. We're going to go up here. There's your brakes, shocks, rear end housing, brakes on that side. Exhaust system is three inch all the way up. Drive shaft did a little red on the pumpkin. Um, there's everything under there. Frame. I'm gonna move this jack back real quick. Ugh. There we go. Okay. There's along the inside. There's your exhaust again. Drive shaft done by Cookson. There's all that. Tranny. Chrome pan. This is kind of cool. This is the oil cooler for the transmission. It's not in the front, it's underneath here. So, moving up to the front here. There's your front brakes way up there. We'll get a shot of those from the other side too. And your oil pan. There's a little radiator action for you. And uh, headers there. High torque starter. I'm going to shut this thing off. Okay, here we go. This is the uh, passenger side. There's your disc brakes right there. If you look down the side, it's really straight. Front brakes. There. Okay, here we go again. This is the driver's side. Brakes straight down the side. Brakes. All right. Okay, here we go. This is down the driver's side. And right here, this piece of chrome was re-chromed on both sides. There's the quarter. Come out of the back. These were re-chromed. Both of these were re-chromed. These are new. There's your bumper. Let me go around here again. This is looking down the side. This car really is very straight for for as old as it is. There's the front. Okay, here we go, inside. Steering wheel, shifter, gauges underneath there. I don't know if I showed you this or not, but this is the switch for the fan. The chrome on the seats is really good, both sides. All that stitching in the back seat is brand new. Headliner. My man Sean's doing a good job with these lights, eh? Even that little light in the back works. I thought that was kind of cool. Um, so that's that. All along in there. And I Alright, a little shot of the trunk. There's a fuel cell. That's the vent. There's a little K&N filter on the other side of that uh, in the back of the car. And this is all trimmed out. That gives you a good idea what that looks like. I will get the end. Okay, I saved the best for last. There's your motor. Headman headers down in there. There's the blower. There's your battery, Griffin radiator with my half inch wrench that I forgot to take off of it. How's that? All the stainless steel braiding. I'll try to show this to you, but some of the wiring, these two lines right there, 
those have wires running through them. I use stainless steel to to uh, sheath those wires and it looked a lot better. So that's about as in depth as I think we can get. Um, even down inside here, it's in it's in real good shape. So uh, horn. And there's your Ford license plate. So I think that's about it, man. Uh, I hope this helps. If you have any other questions, make sure.